13 years ago, the IB considered me a perfect grader when they checked my labs. I didn't do sig figs, I didn't do percentage uh, uncertainties, anything like that. Then they cared a lot about all this business, and now they care a lot less is the latest iteration of their ideas about all this. So don't worry too much about this. But here are the rules. Adding and subtracting, the answer must have the same number of decimal places as that with the least in the question. So this is 14.11 grams, but let's just try and follow the rules. That has two decimal places, that has one. So my answer should only have one decimal place, leaving me with 14.1 grams. A subtraction, same rule, follow the decimal places. So that would give me 97.35 grams. Let's just check the rules. Three decimal places there, two decimal places there. So my answer must have two decimal places, which indeed it does. Different rules for multiplication and division though. The rules for multiplication and division are the answer must have the same number of significant figures as that with the least in the question. So that has four, that has four, so my answer should have four sig figs. Next. Well, that has four, that has three sig figs, so it's 100 to three sig figs. And that point there means that those zeros on the left count between the number and the point. Two sig figs, two sig figs. Now, 100 to two sig figs, I'm so tired of seeing people put 10 or 10 point. That's the right number of sig figs, but it's the wrong number. 100 times, uh, uh, 10 times 10 is 100, not 10. So how can I write 100 to two sig figs uh, using scientific notation? One sig fig times three sig figs, the answer should have one sig fig. And a division, that's got to be one to two sig figs, so 1.0. An evil one that combines these ideas. So following the rules for adding two decimal and three decimal places after, it's 15.00, two decimal places. Now the rest is multiplication and division. So it goes with the sig figs. So I have one sig fig. So the answer is 7.5 in a normal world, ah, but it's eight to one sig fig in IB world. And one tricky little one here. There's no decimal places, 241. Nah, I'm sorry. Hundreds, tens, units. There's no units for that one. Hundreds, tens, units, yeah. So it just has to be the hundreds and tens. So it's not 241, it's 240. 